Hi everyone, I'm Pooja Khan from EmoFreeTherapy.com and in today's video I wanted to address the amazing research that's being done in EFT and the research has grown exponentially over the past couple of years and there are so many people who've contributed so much to the research and I was looking up APA which is American Psychological Association I was looking up the database and I found a number of articles that have been published in American Psychological Association journals and today I wanted to talk about one of the researches that has been published on the Traumatology Journal. This was published in September 2014 and the article is Traumatic Brain Injury Symptoms Improve After PTSD Remediation with EFT. So I'll just uh, explain it quickly what the research was about and what the findings were. So a group of 59 veterans who had clinical levels of PTSD post-traumatic stress disorder, they received EFT, Emotional Freedom Techniques, in a RCT, which is Randomized Control Trial. So Randomized Control Trial is basically when the subjects are randomly assigned to either the experimental group, the group that receives the new intervention that is being tested, or the control group, which is the group that receives the conventional treatment. Now, after six sessions of EFT, it was noticed that 86% percentage drop was there below the clinical threshold and also this remained subclinical below the clinical threshold in the three and the six month follow-ups that were done. The traumatic brain injury reductions were noticed and the symptoms reduced after three sessions and there was even more reduction after six months around 41 percent. So this is pretty significant and this is one study that I wanted to talk about today. In the next video, I'm going to be talking about another remarkable study that was done, the research that is being done in EFT. So if you have any questions, send me a message. And if you're a member of APA, you can access these articles.